The human body has a number of organ systems. In this unit, you'll learn about four of them. The circulatory system, the digestive system, the excretory system, and the respiratory system. The circulatory system consists of the heart, all the blood vessels of the body, and the blood itself. Its functions are to carry oxygen and nutrients to all the cells and carry waste products away from our cells. To keep our body temperature even throughout and to help protect our body from harmful organisms. The next system you learn about is the digestive system. The digestive system consists of the mouth, esophagus, stomach, small and large intestine and various other organs. Its functions are to break down food mechanically into smaller particles, to chemically break large food molecules down into molecules that are small enough to enter our bloodstream, and to eliminate solid wastes that are left over after these processes have occurred. The excretory system consists of two kidneys, a bladder, two tubes called urethras, and one tube called a ureter, and a sphincter muscle. Its function is to filter soluble waste materials from our blood, and to eliminate these wastes from our body in the form of urine. The respiratory system consists of nasal passages, trachea, bronchi, bronchioles, alveoli, and various other parts. It enables air to enter our lungs where an exchange of gases takes place. Oxygen enters the bloodstream and carbon dioxide leaves the bloodstream through the thin walls of the tiny capillaries in the alveoli. And when we breathe out, we eliminate carbon dioxide and some water from our body. These are only the main systems of our body. Our bodies are very complex and there are many more systems, organs and specialized cells that help our bodies operate efficiently. You will learn about these in this course and other courses you take in biology.